My first dive today is on the far north corner of Maya Bay. Maya Bay is on Pipi Lay and it's part of the Pipi Islands National Marine Reserve in the Andaman Sea. Uh, like many of the dive sites on Pipi, there's very good coral coverage from about two or three meters below the surface, dropping down to about 20, 25 meters. At this time of year, the ocean is quite rough and the weather can be quite rough and you can see this long fin bannerfish just struggling with the surge. Uh, he's fighting the surge to try and eat and I'm fighting the surge to try and film him and you can see we're both getting pushed around in the surge there. The fish that I'm filming now is that slender red fish with the blue stripes tucked in behind all those damselfish. Uh, I'm not sure what it is but I think it's a kind of a wrasse. I've been through all my fish ID books and I can't uh, find it. If there's anyone watching that knows what it is, please leave a comment. At this time of year, many of the dive sites are covered in schools of snapper. And I came across this large school about 10 minutes into the dive. The fish that you can see in the foreground there are actually gold band fusiliers. And the yellow fish in the background are all big eye snappers. It was an enormous school. They were just about blocking out the sun. This is quite interesting. It's the egg rose of a large nudibranch called a Spanish dancer. Spanish dancers are normally nocturnal, so I've never actually managed to film one here on PP, but you come across the egg rolls fairly often. Uh, they lay their eggs in this spiral circular pattern, and they're normally this bright pink color. And what you're looking at there is actually tens of thousands of Spanish dancer eggs. This is a very rare kind of scorpion fish. It's called an Indian Ocean Walkman. Uh, you can see just how camouflaged he is. And on the top of his body there, that's actually sand. When I came across him, he was buried in the sand with just his eyes showing. And uh, for the benefit of the camera, I disturbed him a little bit, so he came out. Uh, they're a very rare fish, very unusual. Uh, they don't tend to swim, they tend to walk along the bottom with those claws they have at the front of their body there. This is quite interesting. I was just coming in for a shot of this black spot puffer fish, but then I realised he seemed to be hanging around in this one location and it was because of the hawksbill turtle that was there feeding. Uh, it's quite common that other kinds of reef fish hang around next to the turtles while they're feeding, looking for any free scraps. But it's quite unusual to see a black spot puffer fish behaving this way. It's normally butterfly fish or wrasse that behave like this. Uh, you can see he's just fully intent on staying right there. No matter how close I come in with the camera, he doesn't want to move, which is very unusual for puffer fish. They're normally very difficult to film and they'll swim away as soon as you come close with the camera. Probably many of our viewers think that these hawksbill turtles are quite common and although they're quite common on the reefs of PP, don't forget that they are actually a critically endangered species and we're just very lucky to have a healthy population of them here on PP. Uh, this guy's feeding away on some hard coral there. Uh, I don't know what it is but it must be delicious. The name of the dive site is Maya Bay North. It's on Pipi Lay and you can get there from either Krabby or Phuket.